how to use a metered dose inhaler or an MDI. The equipments needed are an MDI, a spacer and a face mask. This is a metered dose inhaler. And these are different types of volume holding chambers or spacers. A spacer made from a plastic bottle is almost as effective as a commercially available spacer. These are different types of face masks. And this is an assembly of face mask and spacer. Hold the MDI upright between the finger and the thumb. Remove the cap. Shake well four to five times. Connect the spacer to the mouth of the patient keeping the patient's neck slightly extended. Actuate the MDI by pressing the canister. Ask the patient to take a slow and deep breath. Hold for 5 to 10 seconds and then exhale outside the chamber. Now let's revise the steps. Hold the MDI upright between the finger and the thumb. Remove the cap and shake 4 to 5 times. Now actuate the MDI and ask the patient to take a slow and deep breath. And now ask him to hold for 5 to 10 seconds and then exhale outside the chamber. In children less than 3 years of age and those unable to make a good seal with the lips, you can use a face mask. While using a face mask, ensure a proper seal of the mask onto the face. Keep the neck slightly extended. As previously described, shake the MDI 4 to 5 times and actuate into the spacer keeping it upright. Even while using a face mask, a single deep breath and hold is a preferable technique. But if the child cannot do it, then he can breathe normally, that is normal tidal breathing for 5 to 10 times. Therefore, young children or those unable to take a single slow and deep breath can take 5 to 10 tidal breaths either by using a mask or directly by a spacer. Gargles or mouthwash should be done after using MDI containing steroids. Minimize the delay between actuation and beginning of inhalation. Wait for a short while before actuating the MDI again. Device should be actuated only once each time. MDI should be shaken again for the next actuation. Precautions while using an MDI. The patient should not be panting. While actuating, the MDI should not be inverted. Ensure a proper seal of the mask onto the face. The MDI should be shaken before each actuation and the patient should not breathe very rapidly. Thank you for watching.